Hi students, this is Alex here. In this problem, they have given find an analytic function f of z for which the real part is e power x into cos y. So the real part we take it as u. So u is given as e power x into cos y. We have to find partial derivative of u with respect to x. So y is a constant, so cos y is kept as it is e power x derivative is e power x and constant cos y is written as it is. Now we should also find u y. u y is, now x is treated as a constant so e power x stays as it is and cos y derivative is minus sin y. Now we are going to find u x of z comma 0. Wherever x is there we have to substitute z and wherever y is there we have to substitute 0. So this becomes e power z into cos 0. Cos 0 is 1. So this is only e power z. In the same way u y of z comma 0 will be e power z into minus sin 0. Sin 0 is 0. So the entire terms enter term becomes 0. Now we are going to find f of z. f of z is made up of two term. One is u and other is v. So u plus i v. Now from this if we find f dash of z partial derivative with respect to x will be u x plus i v x. But we know CR equations. So by CR equations u x is v y and u y is minus v x. So in place of v x we are going to replace that with minus u y. After this from this f dash of z we can get f of z by Milne Thompson method f of z formula is integral u x of z comma 0 integral with respect to z minus i integral u y of z comma 0 with respect to z that is dz plus c and now we can replace u x of z comma 0 from here which is e power z so this is e power z dz minus i integral u y we got it as 0. So this entire term is 0. So finally we have integral e power z which is e power z and this is 0 and plus c. So we got the analytic function f of z as e power z plus c.